Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we will talk about Luigi Cloud application, specifically the AI heat map feature. One of the reasons we will be talking about this is first, Luigi sponsored this video and guys, even though this is a sponsored video, we are free to discuss anything under the sun. Second, I choose this feature because this is something interesting and very useful. What is AI heat map? It is a tool to help you decide on which access point to buy and where is the best location to place your Wi-Fi router or access point or even CCTV cameras. In my other videos, I usually give you an actual test on how far the access point or the Wi-Fi router can give me a Wi-Fi signal, like a signal in the other room, whether it will penetrate one wall or two walls and so on and so forth. And that gives you an idea if it is a good Wi-Fi router to buy, but remember, my house is built differently from your house, so it is just an idea of the review that I'm providing you. But with this AI heat map, it will allow you to upload the blueprint of the house to see what area will that Wi-Fi router or access point cover. Or how many access points do you need to cover the entire area? I think I'm talking a lot and it might not actually make sense for you, but now I'll try to show you on how to access the AI heat map and show you how to configure and play with it using my laptop. But guys, don't get me wrong, you can also use your mobile device and install the application, the Luigi Cloud application on your mobile device and use the AI heat map application on your mobile device as well. Now, let's try to access it using my laptop. Okay, on the web portal, enter the credentials that you have created and click on login. Then after that one, you will be redirected to the main page and on the top, you'll be able to see their AI heat map. Click on that one and a new window will pop up. And right now we don't have any BOM that was created. Okay, let's click on create BOM. And maybe name this BOM JK Residence. And of course, this is a home and BOM description. And let's just try description. Okay, then click OK. And after that one, you'll be redirected to this one. And currently, we don't have any floor plan or blueprint uploaded. Click on this upload floor plan. Okay, and maybe let's try to click on pictures. And we have here Chavez Residence Sheet A02. And click on that one. Enter the name of this sheet. And maybe let's enter uh, second floor. Okay, and after that one, you'll be able to... See here, create scale, actual area. This is around 78 meters on the second floor. 78 square meters and click OK. Then after that one, operation succeeded. And as you can see, this is the actual floor plan or the house that we have right now. Then maybe let's try to enter a product that we will use on this house for the testing later on. So maybe uh, 1200 G. Okay. Click on add and as you can see it was already placed on the floor plan or the blueprint and click on a location like for this one on the game room this is where we'll be setting this router to test later on okay and as you can see here there are color coded area like for example we have red yellow and green for the red one usually it is weak signal or no signal at all or maybe the yellow one was as Stronger signal compared to the red one and the green is actually the excellent signal strength that you can have. Okay, it is also indicated on the bottom 10% poor for the red, yellow for 48% and 42 and so on and so forth. And aside from that one, yes, you can see here there are some areas that is red inside the master's bedroom. You can create or buy a new Wi-Fi router or an access point and place it on that location. So place it maybe here on the... In front of the bed and as you can see all the area inside the house has green color coding meaning we have a good signal strength on every location on this second floor okay maybe let's, let's just remove this one delete and aside from that one from this ai heat map application you can see here that currently the signal simulation is on 5g you can choose 2.4g as you can see Everything, almost everything on the master's uh, toilet and bath is actually green and yellow compared using the 5 gig 
Wi-Fi network. Because 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi network has better Wi-Fi range compared to the 5 GHz Wi-Fi network. But guys, always remember that 5 GHz Wi-Fi network is more stable compared to the 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi network. And aside from that one, you also have the camera simulation. Unfortunately, we don't have any camera with us. So we won't be able to show you this one. So maybe let's try to check if there's a camera available. Okay, there's no camera. Okay, let's try that one later on, maybe on another video. And aside from this, maybe let's try to check the walls, guys. For the walls, every house has different uh, configuration or wall structure. Like, for example, in my house, maybe this is set to medium, but in your house, maybe it's set to thick. As you can see, if it's thicker, the wall is thicker. Like, for example, a concrete elevator or your steel sheet, it will give you less signal on other locations. But if you have thin, almost all area on the master's toilet and mat is actually green or yellow and for now let's try to click on medium okay and aside from that one what else do we have here this is it and of course you can also export this one to give it to your um, contractor or network engineer to check on which actually wi-fi router or access points you need on this blueprint or floor plan okay this doesn't make any sense if it's just a diagram color coding red yellow and green of course we need to test okay guys now for the actual test let's try to check if the one that we have configured or uploaded on that ai heatmap which cloud application is giving us a great or accurate result based on the color coded that it's shown us earlier on the 1200g pro wi-fi router from Luigi. okay and i'll be using my mobile phone this is a poco phone and currently on this area, okay, I would just like to discuss first the application that we're using. This is a Wi-Fi analyzer. It's not that 100% accurate there are uh, some delay or lag on this application, but I'll just give you the gist of this one. Like for example, right now the 1200G Pro is around uh, negative 65, which, uh, meaning, which means that we are still able to access the internet or we are still connected on the 1200G Pro, okay? As soon as it hits, like for example, negative 50, negative 40, that is better Wi-Fi signal strength. When we go lower, like for example, like uh, negative 70, negative 80, negative 90, that is the worst signal strength that we will be able to connect on that Wi-Fi router. Okay, right now, on this area, on the diagram or the blueprint that we have uploaded, the same house, the same structure, this is red. Okay, meaning for the red one is it can have a low signal connection or low signal strength or no signal at all. Right now, we are able to get around negative 65 on this area. Okay, in the diagram, if I move further on this location, like for example, facing the door, we have a yellow connection, meaning we should have better signal strength if we move on this area. This will be the worst one, this is red. And of course, on the diagram, if we move further on that area, it's green, better signal strength or better connectivity. So right now, I'll try to move on this area, okay? Okay, and right now we are facing the door. Let's wait for a couple of seconds. Okay guys, and it took us a couple of seconds or maybe a minute to actually auto-calibrate the Wi-Fi analyzer. And as you can see here, we are now at around negative maybe uh, 55 so minus 10 db for the signal strength meaning we have better connection on this area because we actually hit negative 55 compared to the negative 65. okay to put it into context maybe let's try to check it on um speed test okay so where is my speed test on this one okay we have speed test loading on this area this is a yellow area on the Diagram again or the blueprint meaning better Wi-Fi signal strength compared to this area where there is red on the blueprint. Okay, and we have converge and let's try to do a speed test. Oh, cancel, cancel. Sorry, we are not using Telmark, so let's try to choose maybe converge passing. Okay, and let's hit test again. Okay, on this area, this yellow area, we are getting around 197 Mbps for download and 169 Mbps for upload. Just to make sure, 
we are connected on the Rigi 1200G Pro underscore 5G, okay? So if I move on this area, which actually uh, our red area based on the AI heatmap application, we should get less than the 197 Mbps for download and less than 169 Mbps for the upload. That should be the concept. Of course, let's try to do the actual test if it will give us the great result. Okay guys, as you can see, we are getting 171 Mbps for download, while for the upload, we are getting 99.1 Mbps. And of course, let's try to check the results earlier. Okay, and as you can see here, the result on this area where it is actually red on the Blueprint or AI heatmap application, we are getting around 171 Mbps for download, while 99.1 Mbps for upload. When we try to move on this area, the yellow area, we are getting around 197 Mbps for download and 169 Mbps for upload. Okay, and that actually gives us a better idea if that AI heat map actually is giving us an accurate result on placing an access point or Wi-Fi router on each location on the blueprint or maybe house design that you have uploaded. For my conclusion, you have seen the actual test it was able to give us a good result and it is very similar to the AI heat map application that we have configured earlier. The red area has less signal and less speed while the yellow part has better signal and better speed. And this tool will actually hasten your wireless network deployment for you will be able to know on how many access points you need and where is the strategic location on to place those access points. And the best thing is this AI heat map application is actually free. Okay, guys, even though this is a great tool that will help you decide on which access point to buy and place on a strategic location, please still check on the future Ruji product that we will review on this channel. And I think that will be all for now. I hope you have learned something from this one. And if you have comments, suggestions, comment down below or message me at JP Chavez on Epi. And if you want to request another feature from Ruji or other products, just message me or comment down below. And again, guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Stay safe and bye.